What is going on guys, it's Topher Deluxe back with another Elite Weapon review as well as some Black Ops 3 talk and did anybody get to see that Star Wars trailer? It was freaking epic, I cannot wait it doesn't make so it's going to be awesome. <laughs> My nerd inside is going crazy right now. I'm so excited about that new Star Wars. And as well as the Battlefront game, which looks amazing. It looks pretty good. Um, I can't wait to see what they can do with that engine when it's actually in gameplay instead of just engine footage like they said in the preview. So what you're watching right here is the AMR9 Dynamo. Now this one has a rate of fire and I believe a mobility nerf or a buff, excuse me, and which makes it pretty much like a bullet hose. And as you can tell right there, I've got foregrip on, foregrip on this. Um, rocking just foregrip and the uh, red dot. But you can tell it really doesn't have much recoil. I'm playing on like a 6 sensitivity. So it, I'd be all over the place if I was fighting it too hard. So this gun is actually really, really good. And if you put rapid fire on there, which I didn't do at this video. This is just right after. Um, I believe it's right after I unlocked the royalty camo for the SMGs. I've got the SMGs and the assault rifles down. I'm about, uh, I just got the diamond links today, which was a pain in the badonka donk, man. Seriously, if you have elite weapons, just get that gun diamond, and then you don't have to worry about it. Because when you try and get diamond guns and you don't have elite weapons to do it with, it is a pain in the butt. But anyways, <laughs> uh, that's, that's just, I'm getting off topic right now. So... This gun is good. If you run rapid fire, it makes it burst a little bit faster, makes it run a little faster, and it is awesome. Aside from that, Black Ops 3 is right around the corner. We're going to be getting it this year, this fall, this season for Black Ops 3. The new uh, trailer is coming out here in like just a week or so. Uh, my teammate said my butt right here because I didn't know that guy was still alive. <laughs> But I am super, super hyped about Black Ops 3. Black Ops 2 was by far my favorite Call of Duty that's ever been made. I thought it had the best weapon balance, the best map design, the most satisfying score streaks. Right here, I'm running a missile strike with two extra missiles and the Nano Swarm, and it gets me maybe two or three kills every time I use it. Not very satisfying, whereas the Lightning Strike or something of that similar uh, point range, which with that one, that, that was like a thousand point thing right there that's that's a little bit higher up the scale it's like a stealth chopper or something like that you could have gotten a lot more kills with it either way and this was this was actually before they nerfed the godforsaken freaking sentry guns to make them the one hit kill that's so stupid i hate that sentry guns are completely useless now if you're running sentry guns in advanced warfare just stop because you're wasting your time one Blind Eye is completely overpowered, makes you immune to all score streaks except for UAV. So we put UAV on, or low profile, and Blind Eye, and nothing that anybody calls in will even detect that you're there. That is stupid overpowered. Sorry for my rant, but that's just the way I feel. And then they nerfed the, the uh, <laughs> God, I'm ranting like crazy. They nerfed the uh, turret, where it's, instead of taking three melees to kill, it only takes one melee. So that means that even with someone with out blind eye if they're quick and they can run up onto it they will knock it out no problem and that is really really annoying because it completely makes the turret 100 percent obsolete there's i never get more than one or two kills with a turret now after they made that nerf it's just stupid so onward black ops 3 is going to be amazing i'm probably going to get all of my camos all royalty camo for this game and star wars is going to be the shit <laughs> So leave a like for this video. 27 and 5, that's a 5.4, I think, KD. Um, doing some work with this AMR Dynamo. This is Tofu Lux, and I'm out.